Okay, guys, so since learning about magnetic filament, sorry, my walking is still janky. So, do you see, like, normally I used to think of a cornfield as, like, total chaos. But now that I know about magnetic filaments coming straight from the earth, like, straight out of the ground, everything, like, there's a reason this all defies, like, there's a reason these defy all gravity. Do you know what I mean? Like, gravity is made by magnetic filaments as well. So how is all of this so tall? I mean, look at it, I wanna show you this. Like, I'm a pretty tall person. This is to my breast, you guys. Do you understand, this is, a, this is my belly button. Like, let me show you. This is my belly button, here. Belly button is here. That's how tall this is. Let's see if you can get it from the side. That's my belly button right here. This thing is taller. It's all the way down from there to my belly button like inches past so it's like up to like it's almost to my bra honestly but I've started to see like all of this is defying gravity and now I know that it's following a magnetic filament up from the earth it's following the electricity up that's why it's all in a strong row so now that I understand that corn is just following electricity up hello little bug I hope you're not a bad bug I hope you don't bite. Oh, crap. I realize that I don't go outside much, so I don't know about the wildlife here. I might be getting eaten alive by something. But do you start to see the order? I think the corn stalks come off of the magnetic filaments that are brushing off as gravity fights it, as other magnetic filaments press down. I think the corn stalk there goes up on a magnetic filament, goes to the sky that's stronger, and then the branches that come off, do you see how there's order to it? Daddy's calling. All right, come in.